What's up, everybody? This is Zach with the Nerd Cave Network, and today I'm bringing you Star Wars Battlefront. Yes, I said it, Star Wars Battlefront. This is a game that I've been waiting to play for a very, very long time, since E3 when they showed the first little clip of the walker stomping down on the snowspeeder on Hoth. So, guys, I'm excited to bring it to you. I'm going to jump into multiplayer. Um, there's a lot of different things, fighter squadron, droid ones, supremacy, um, tons of different things that you can play in here. I'm going to jump into fighter squadron, um, during the, the beta, I played some of fighter squadron and I'm well, not a fighter squad. I played as a tie fighter and everything during the Walker assault and was horrible at it. Uh, I did play a little bit before this. I had a whole set of Let's Plays done, but for some odd reason, didn't record my voice. So I'm redoing these. I had a really awesome battle, which uh, I might put put up just to show everyone that uh, I can go a whole game without dying. And I really, really have enjoyed the game so far. So what squadron is based on is you pretty much you pretty much uh, play as a fighter ah that's how you slow down wasn't really sure on that to be honest but uh plays a squadron and you just fight the whole time through you know just different skirmishes and they send in I'm not sure where everyone's at you just fight through and kill people pretty much and then the big ship comes in and you try to destroy it so I'm playing as a fight a type interceptor and it's pretty easy to just get some kills it's there are some AI in here but when you actually get You can see their name pop up and it gives you more you get more points for destroying actual fighters instead of AI fighters kind of like how kind of like how um, what was that game Titanfall worked with the AI fighters and there they're pretty easy to pick off but it's just something where people can feel feel good about themselves while you know you know being able to you know skilled players go after more of the pilots and then you know you get people that kind of like me are in the middle of the batch that go after AIs, go after pretty much everything that's... I need to find some help. So, so far that's my first death in this one. We're winning 95 to 51. We're going to try, I think it goes up to 100. Let's see what we got here. Oh. Vehicle repair. I don't need that right now. So now their transport should be coming in very soon. transport ship the more damage you do to this the better transport damage transport damage all right let's uh, I didn't want to be a tie fighter but that's okay so the more damage you do the better you are you're off you want to be one of the ones that gets the most damage. 
Um, just the... Just the awesomeness of being able to f fight. There we go. Fight in the air above these grand landscapes and everything is just such a cool... Just a cool little thing. Sorry, I'm getting distracted by killing people. It's hard to, to focus all the way through this. Oh, should have done the, not a barrel roll, but the flip around. Uh, I do actually like the A-Wing better than anything else so far. We'll see what I can uh, do against the Millennium Falcon. Let's keep up with it. Scanners have detected a GR-75 fleeing the area. Target and destroy. All right, let's go get this. You. Oh well, I blew up on it. <laughs> Should be uh, dead by the time I get back in there. Twelve seconds left, and there we go. Victory right there. Did pretty good. Uh, got third overall. Five kills, eight AI kills, four deaths. Um, I have pretty good kill death ratio right there. I would say. I'm. I really like Squadron. It's so far my favorite part. Um, I've played the hero battles. That's uh, three heroes against three villains, and then you have some people that play as normal militia um it's pretty interesting you have to be very smart playing it but the most fun that i've had so far is playing on the squadron uh it's just fast paced it's a lot of fun i like more of the rebel side the a wing's really really cool especially with um the shield that you get and just the way it maneuvers is a little bit better than the other ones but I, I'm really, really enjoying the game. I'm going to probably do another match just so you can see how it is. And I'm going to be playing as a rebel so you can see the A-Wing. All right, let's go ahead and jump in. Haven't even played with the X-Wing yet. But you can see just the, the graphics of this, the visual fidelity of the whole game is just on fleek as I would say I'm getting more and more used to oh well he dodged that one this guy's good Get some easy kills right here. Boom! Chaka laka laka boom. Guys, if you haven't seen the other Let's Plays that I've been doing on the channel, make sure you're checking those out. So far, I've done. I've done, um, La not Last of Us, I've done Until Dawn, that's the, the game I'm trying to talk about. I've done, been doing those, been doing, um, there we go. I've 
done Until Dawn, done some Fallout as well, have done Journey, Halo 5, tons of stuff that is available on the channel that I would love for you to check out. I've been putting a lot of hard work in on... Boom, boom, nope, no boom. All right, let's go get this Imperial shuttle. Let's get this. Come on, come on, come on, come on. There we go, there we go. There we go. Boom. But yeah, definitely be checking those out. We also have some great interviews from the last few conventions that we've been to from Fanaticon and Fandom Con. And, oh, there we go. Um, have voice actors from Dragon Ball Z, Master Roshi, and Whis from the newer movies. So definitely check those out. Also, Bulbasaur. So tons of things that you can forgot this thing has a shield but you can definitely check all of those out on the channel that you're on right now there we go boom bye bye I have you now. Bye bye. Behind you, behind you. Rebel transport leaving. So, fixing to get a the shot at. So this is one of our transports trying to escape. So we're gonna have to. have to defend it here GR75 transport destroyed tisk tisk I am going to get this guy There we go Boom Got another one. I'm doing pretty good this game. These are pretty easy pickings when they're just chasing the Millennium Falcon. I don't have any missiles yet, and I'm out of ammo. Victory! Woo! Up oh, there we go. Number one. Nine kills. Eight AI kills. One death. Pretty good, guys. I'm enjoying the game. Definitely make sure you check it out. Um, I'll be playing more and more. If you want to play with me, let me know. If there's something you want to see, guys, any kind of game mode that you want to see me play, tackle, let me know in the comments below. Make sure you subscribe, guys, so you don't miss any of the action-packed Battlefront that I'll be doing. Also, we'll be doing more and more of Until Dawn, so catch up with that. It's a lot of fun to see me jump and scream. So, guys, make sure you do that. And check out our podcast that comes out every Tuesday on iTunes and Stitcher Radio. Uh, it's called the Nerd Cave Podcast. We're on Facebook, Twitter, Instagram, Tumblr, all of the social medias, Nerd Cave Network. So make sure you check us out, follow us. And, guys, thank you for watching. Have a week.